Hello Cloud Gurus and welcome to AWS This Week and I have some really cool announcements this week including Amazon Elasticsearch service now supports three availability zone deployments, AWS Site-to-Site -Site VPN now supports IKEE version 2, you can now develop and test AWS step function workflows locally and we announce our Guru of the Week. You're watching AWS This Week with me Faye Ellis. Amazon Elasticsearch Service now supports three availability zone deployments. And if you haven't used Elasticsearch before, it's a fully managed search and analytics engine commonly used for log, security, and business analytics. And you can now deploy your Elasticsearch cluster across three availability zones instead of just two, providing much greater availability. And if you already have a two zone configuration, you can easily reconfigure to use three availability zones at no extra cost. AWS Site-to-Site -Site VPN now supports IKEE version 2. And IKEE v2 stands for Internet Key Exchange version 2. And it's the underlying VPN technology used to enable communication between instances in your VPC and systems in your own data center. And version 2 is regarded as one of the most advanced VPN protocols available, consuming less bandwidth, supporting more authentication protocols, as well as support for mobile devices. You can now develop and test AWS Step Functions locally using AWS Step Functions Local. And if you're not familiar with Step Functions, it's a web service which allows you to visually build out your application workflow for distributed applications and microservices. And there's now a new downloadable version of Step Functions, which allows you to develop and test applications completely in your own data center which is going to be great for latency sensitive use cases, as well as for highly secure environments which are isolated from the internet. And the software is available either as a jar file or a Docker image with all the dependencies and configuration built in to get you started as quickly as possible. So on to Guru of the Week, and the correct answer this week was C, and the person with the best answer is Maria Ferrier. And Maria is a lead data engineer at MyDrive Solutions in London. So congratulations to Maria. There's a Cloud Guru t-shirt, sticker, and hand-signed card on their way to you in the post, and you are also in the draw to win the free ticket to reInvent 2019. Please see the link below for this week's question, which is now live on our Facebook page. And that is all from me. You've been watching AWS this week. Keep being awesome, Cloud Gurus, and I'll see you next time.